What's going on guys, Bacon here, and today we're gonna take a look at my team and then I'm going to announce and show you Bacon's All-Stars. We're gonna get this rolling. I think I'm gonna do a season with them, so anyway. But you guys wanted to see my regular team, so I'm just gonna show you real quick. We're gonna go through it. I picked up a few new guys. I've actually been stacking my team. Like, stacking the boys. I was using base cards most of the year, but check me out. Check me out. Now, I just got them. Uh, nine, ten games ago, Stanley Cup Grats. I got the Grats. I got the great one, the Gretzky. I got the Gret I got the great one. Yeah, I got the great one. He's playing with the magnificent Mario, and we have the upgraded Team of the Year Voracek. So I upgraded him quite a while ago. Just got the Grats nine, ten games ago, and Mario Lemieux has been around for a while. So line number one is a beast. Is a beast. Gretzky's over a point a game in those ten games. Anyway, line two, Stanley Cup Dadsuk. I upgraded him quite a bit ago as well, and. And Pavel Bure, I mean, this line is deadly. I mean, sure, I could upgrade the hall, but I don't, I mean, he's pretty fucking good. He's pretty good. I got almost a million pucks. I could definitely upgrade these guys, but how could I? These base cards are solid. They're solid enough. Anyway, base card Taylor Hall. People all the time say, what is that hall? What is it? Is it like, what? Do you got him boosted? Are you just playing pretty good? No, no, no. Base card. Base card, guys. Base. Anyway. Henrik Zetterberg just got him not that long ago. He's played, I don't even know how many games, probably over 20, but hasn't been around that long. We have the Movember Gabrick and the base card Duchesne. This is a card you need if you don't have a crazy ass amount of pucks. What am I doing? Anyway, if you don't have a crazy ass amount of pucks, you need Matt Duchesne. He's quick off the line. So is the Gabrick, but this guy's fairly cheap quick off the line he can go Zedberg's not a nang like him like Duchesne nang but uh he can snipe he can say he's good enough anyway nang speaking of that we have team of the year Haglin he's not that expensive you can get him anyway Haglin's fast I just like him there he's probably the worst player on my team but anyway <laughs> nang he just goes right Krejci most underrated 89 in this game I don't know why I like him so much but I just kind of like how he feels out there it's just good it's just good anyway Phil Castle Phil the thrill base guard been on the team all year he got demoted though but i like to have him fresh he can snipe there when everybody else is tired throw that fourth line these guys get a lot of points a lot of points catch them late in the game that fourth line beast best card in the game best player in this game duncan keith crazy right actually people always ask me what my favorite cards to use are the grats i had the normal legend before or beret got to be them too the stanley cup datsuk is like a million pucks so i could easily say him but it's either grats or Bure. they're both a beast but if i got to go defenseman wise duncan keith absolutely amazing says 88 skating feels a lot faster he's just good you gotta have him uh let's see so peter angelo also had him for a long time Doughty, solid as a rock. We got base cards here, right? So, Team of the Year, Cromwell, I upgraded him after the Cromwell hit. I mean, he didn't get a chance to be upgraded in Stanley Cup Finals. You know what I mean? Like, if if he didn't get kicked out, though, the Red Wings would be in the Finals. You guys know what I'm saying? You guys agree? All right, let's go. So, Team of the Week, Headman, I haven't had him that long. Team of the Week! Team of the Week! So, I haven't had him that long. And then I upgraded to Milestone Carlson. I could get the Team of the Year, but whatever. This is good enough. It's pretty good, right? So... Headman's a little bit slow. I'm thinking I maybe get the Chara instead. I don't know. I might throw Chara. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Paddy Wah, I just got him. He's only been 10 games, and he does let in a lot of weak ones. He makes the unreal save, and then he lets in the weakest, the weakest one. But I haven't lost since I've had him. He's like the ice tilt equalizer. It's like, even though I'm getting screwed some games, I still manage to go down and kind of get one back. I don't know. I don't know. I wouldn't say he's outstanding, but I think he's got an ice tilt underlay. Like I think, I think he, I think he just melts the ice tilt. I really think so far so good. Too early to tell. Ten games in. Let me show you his stats. Let me show you his stats. So first, take a look at the Gretz. Nine games played with him. I got him. Nobody else played a game with this card. He was a virgin. The Gretz was a virgin. Look at that face. He was a virgin. And yeah, so he has ten points in nine games, six goals, four assists. Plus nine, just a beast. Four penalty minutes. What a goon. All right, let's check Patty Watt. Look, 10 games played, 12 wins, minus two losses. He's so good they gave him minus losses. I don't know. I don't. Look, one goals against average, 88 save percentage. Doesn't matter. Minus two losses, bitches. Minus two. <laughs> I really don't know what the hell happened there. I just have to show that. 12 wins in 10 games, minus two lot. I don't get it. I don't get it. It's unreal, though. Let's get to the All-Stars. You guys want to see it? All right, let's check it out.
Here we go. Bacon's All-Stars, ladies and gentlemen. This has been long, long, long time coming. And he heard it. Nang, nang. And the grease ball, Steve Downey. That's our line one. Come on, nang. Stanley Cup, nang. We have the normal base card, nang. And then we got the grease ball, Steve Downey. I don't know. We'll get back to you about it. So quick sell, Neil. Chris Bark. Chris Bark. So we got quick, quick, quick sell, Neil. We got, we'll get back to you soon, Alfredson. And then Chris Bark. No, we got, we had to bring in Little Todd for his sniping. I gave him the offensive dad suit, the best player in the entire world. He is definitely ultimate, but you're not ultimate for Steve. You're not ultimate. But anyway, so I had to put dad suit, the most finesse, best hands in the National Hockey League, unless you want to talk about Patty Kane. I mean, it's close. It's got to be close, right? We could debate about it. We could talk. Anyway, had to put dad suit with the sniper, Little Burt. Little Burt, right? From the Bronze Squad. You remember the Bronze Squad? Little Burt. It's Little Burt. You're not ultimate. All right. Brooks likes that. Ninja Hurdle. And then I got Nutshot Lucic. I got Nutshot Lucic. So anyway, nang, nang. You're such a grease ball. On defense, we have the defensive Datsuk, Andre Padan. And I had to put him with our weakest link, the ultimate teal, Kyle Quincy. I mean, Jesus Quincy. I had to... I don't know who put him on the squad, but I had to put our strongest asset with our weakest link, Quincy. God damn it, Quincy. So we're really relying on the defensive dad. So we got hot Carl, and then we had to upgrade to my favorite defenseman. <laughs> Somebody's getting Cromwell. Somebody's getting Cromwell like it's game seven. So the Vlasic Pickle had to be on the team, but what I'm going to do, whoever's playing with Hot Carl, you guys are going to decide, and I need you to let me know in the comment section below who should fill the final spot. But in that, we have Tukarski! Tukarski! We have Tukarski in that. Oh my god. So, you guys want to see who's our coach? Fiddler! Gotcha, bitch! <laughs> How the f did you get here? Who the f let you in here, Fiddler? Fiddler! Gotcha, bitch! Alright, why you have to be Matt? Why? He's our backup, but Tukarski! He's got the glue. He's got the green light on this one. Anyway, that is our squad. I need you guys to let me know who's gonna fill that final spot. I don't care if he's a right defenseman. He could be a forward for all I care. Just vote for the player who should be on Bacon's All-Stars. I'm sure I'm missing somebody who you guys think should be on this squad. So let me know in the comment section below. We're going to do a season. I think I'm going to do a season. Might, unless it's just one. I don't know. How the hell is our line chem? How the hell is our team chemistry 7-3? Jesus. EA, are you shitting me? These guys are All-Stars. These guys are fucking great. I don't know. Anyway, I think I can win Division 1 with this squad. Takarski. Hopefully you guys like this video. Let me know. Who's going to take this spot? We'll see you guys soon.